My name is Nat Jones. My majors are biology, art history, and Japanese, and I use they, them pronouns. I want to be a physician researcher, uh, working in the clinic and doing uh, long-term projects with my patients, and specifically I want to go into the field of transgender health, which is an up-and-coming, big burgeoning field that needs a lot of it just needs a lot of help right now. There's hardly any people researching it from, except for some hot spots in San Francisco and New York. Um, it's, there's a great deal of need for different research projects. Um, and as a transgender person myself, it's really close to my heart. And so I've seen all my studies of the more humanities and liberal arts and other cultures as a way to kind of expand my way of interacting with people that come from different walks of life from me. Um, so it's just been a great exercise in preparing myself to interact with different patient groups in my future career as transgender focused physician scientist. As a physician I want to engage in that research and study my patients long term, one on one, do some long term case studies, um, try and understand what exactly does testosterone do to a person with two X chromosomes if they're on it for 20 years, do they have to get their uterus removed within four years, do they, like all that stuff is completely unknown um, and additionally why are we promoting certain therapies for transgender individuals, why are we saying oh you want to be a trans man? You want to have kids? What is that? You're not truly a trans man then. You, you want to give birth? Why? I want to create these spaces in medicine for trans people to still have families um, as their natural biological bodies would allow them to because currently if you are a trans man and you go to a doctor and you say yes I still want to keep my uterus ovaries I want to be able to have kids they would probably say you're not truly trans depending on where you are and keep you from pursuing further therapies. So basically deconstructing the binaries in medicine that we have right now in Western medicine in America and understanding why we have them through a medical humanities perspective, how they evolved, what we can do to sort of detangle them and understand what's truly best for transgender patients as a whole. It really was the perfect fit for me. It connected me to so many opportunities that, will I, that I will continue to reap benefits from years on down the road. And I, can't imagine being connected to any of the fellowships, service programs, leadership opportunities at any other school in the whole country.